I need a workshop trolley, specifically a metal one, but the ones that I've seen in stores and online are just too expensive, and my budget is only about half of that. So let's make a metal workshop trolley. This is Cossador Jonathan here. An inexpensive trolley is probably not hard to acquire and buying secondhand is a really good option because that's recycling. But I've been unable to find anything that's in my price range. I know how much a basic metal workshop trolley costs and it's something that I don't have. So I'm going to have to be creative. So what exactly is a trolley? A trolley is a shelf on wheels with a handle. But what do I want? I need it to be as tall as my benches, which is 1,075 millimeters. It needs to be metal, repeatable, and affordable. Okay, easy. I found this flat pack shelf at the hardware store. I'll use these casters as wheels. And for the handle, I'll use this curtain rail. And I've got some extra bolts for attaching the casters and the handle. To put this together, I'm going to need a few tools, a drill and some bits, metal shears, a hacksaw, a hammer, a permanent marker, and some sandpaper. And optionally, a little bit of spray paint. The casters are 43 millimeters tall, so I need to make my shelf 1032 millimeters tall. And with a bit of luck, I won't need to drill any extra holes. The flat pack shelf contains some instructions that I don't need. Uprights, the shelves, some bolts, and some right angle brackets. I mark it out so I know where I want my shelves to be. And I assemble my shelf. Excluding the top, I put all of the shelves upside down so that there are edges on each of the shelves and when I wheel the trolley around, nothing wobbles and drops off. Now that it's assembled, I turn it upside down so I can put on the casters. I place the casters right into the corners and with a permanent marker, I mark out where I need to drill my holes and I drill the holes. I bolt the casters on and that's done. For the handle, I'm using curtain rail. I don't have any brackets for the curtain rail, so I'm going to improvise. I measure out the curtain rail to the length that I need, and I cut it off. I measure out each of the side pieces that will be attached onto the trolley. I cut the curtain rail most of the way through on both of the marks. And then I flatten one side. I clamp down the flattened side, and then I flatten the other side and I drill the holes where it's going to attach to the trolley. I take off any loose paint with some sandpaper. I bend in the sides and I trim off any overhanging pieces with some metal shears. I paint it with a bit of industrial gray just because I like the color and it matches a little bit better. With a permanent marker, I draw where I need to drill any holes on the trolley and I drill the holes. Then I bolt on the handle. And that's it, it's done. An easy, cheaper, repeatable, metal workshop trolley. I know that not everyone will have access to the same materials that I did, but it's important to look at an object as its components because then it empowers you to make it yourself. And if it was useful to you, please like and subscribe. If you would like me to make something else, let me know in the comments. And remember guys, break it till you make it, and I'll see you next time.